Yo, got him deep. Got him deep. Wide open. Not wide open, but I'll take that. Come on, come on. Fight for me. Ah. Wow. Thought you could get me with the run. Give me that rock. I don't know. Oh, no. Oh! Maverick fam, how's it going? How's your mama? Your boy Dion back on this wild card football, man. Loving this game. Last episode, we jumped into the leagues, okay? I thought that was the offline mode. It wasn't. We actually, you know, got mashed up with a human, which I want to do more of, but my team is trash. We got that 55 overall. There's no way to buy packs. I know some people love that. I don't. You know, most of the people that love that got a bunch of time to just grind and put in the game. I don't. And so the people that are grinding are kicking my butt. Not, not that I've actually played them, but I've seen people with 70, 80 overall teams. And I'm like, just trying to do the math on how much they got to play to get there. Obviously, we can get lucky, hopefully get some good players that we pull maybe that could boost it up big time. But I feel like even for a lot of the players, let's go look at my roster. You even have to level them up. Like I have a gold Colin Kaepernick that said a 66, you know, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to play games games you see he can get xp and we'll just have to level that up and so i don't know which mode is the best to do that right now we did the tour i want to do or i'm sorry we did the league last time i want to do the tour in this video it kind of has like a i don't know like a battle pass looking thing but you see it's tour number one and there's little packs that you get the further you go and i think the higher we get up this will just unlock better packs better things and so this is worth us checking out so we're gonna do a game here and i'm assuming this should actually be against the computer i'm going against the fort wayne heroes yep a cpu team at 53 overall that's what i like to see if you guys are enjoying this make sure you guys check out our other channel we'll have that linked in the description but we've been doing couch tournaments with this game and it's been crazy so if you want to see me play against trent juice fred make sure you're checking that out those games have been epic we got a video that's either going up today or tomorrow that's probably one of the better best games you will ever see in wild card football i'm talking an overtime thriller featuring your boy and uh it, it's gonna be our next tournament upload for this so but i just like i got so much to learn and improve with in this game I don't feel good yet. And I think one of the coolest things is that not only can we build our team the more we play, but we're also going to build a deck. Yeah, you're trash. I feel like I feel like Trent, Juice, or Fred would have intercepted that with some of the gameplay we've had. So like we can like find I'm pretty sure we can customize our playbook, like the actual type of plays that we'll have in there, but also our deck you know so we could have a deck that leans towards slowing people more or you know just doing whatever you might want to do and for someone that's also a nerd you know i'll play games like hearthstone where you're building decks and oh that was bad i think i need to lob those but like i love those games where you got to build your your deck you got to manage your mana and just so to have that mixed with football is pretty crazy. I'm trying to play this drive without using many cards. Especially with them having to lower overall, I think I should be able to cook. That's not open. That's not open. Is there a way to throw the ball away? Because I really just need to throw that away there. Come on, come on! Fight for me! Ah! And for some of my first games when I was playing, you know, it felt really slow. Almost like slow paced, like with some of the, the play calling and just trying to pick the cards. But the more I've played it and played with people that are getting comfortable with it, it has a nice rhythm to it when two people really know what they're doing. You know, you only got so many plays and, you know, so you go and you pick your play and then even this process gets quicker because you know your cards, you know what you're trying to do and it's just in and out, nice and flowy. Really good experience. So if you guys haven't checked this game out, man, I... I'm urging people to pick it up. If you are more of a simulation kind of guy, I don't think this is you're going to get your fix here. Like, this isn't going to replace Madden. This is something different. It's so like, for everyone looking for, like, the super realistic football, I don't think you're going to get that here. I figured out how to look at my plays, by the way, and so I can know how to who to use her. But I do think there are going to be people that play this instead of Madden now because you get enough of the football in this. You do get that from this. And I hear there's ways to plays without the cards too. So if you don't want to have all the power-ups, you can do that. And while I'm not using any of the cards now, I'm just kind of, I'm honestly just trying to figure something out. Why are my guys so far back? Is that something he played? Oh, it was a punt. Oh, okay. He, I didn't realize he was punting. And one thing I noticed with playing with a lot of the like default teams, 
Come on now. Let's go. Yep, that's my that's McLaurin, man. That's my best wideout. Get in there. I was totally about to make a point before my guy broke free. I forgot what I was going to say. Hopefully, it comes back to me. No, sir. Get that out of here. Heck no. Ah, I still don't know, like, the user positioning perfectly. Because you can really, like, undercut certain passes to make some interceptions. Wide receiver pass. See? And then sometimes your guys just do stu stupid stuff like that. I also know there's a diving catch now. And I didn't do it there. I sure tried it. Wow, I was trying to get cocky. Thought I didn't need my cards. Yeah, let me start using them, boy. Yeah, wow, wow. Okay, you nullified my card. Still got Rundy. Come on. Oh, I was not expecting run there. Hey, really got a first two? That's crazy. Nope. Come on now. Let's go defense. All right, hit him with that turtle speed. I got the running back. He's the only one not manned up. He didn't even go out. We're good. User pick. Okay. I don't think I got that with the users, but I'll take it. We got 29 seconds. Hit him with this turtle speed unless they counter it. Wow, and he would give his cornerbacks luck. Still got burnt like toast. Right. Dang it. Never mind. Let's go. We reduce that cornerback speed again. Should get. Oh, got him deep. Got him deep. Wide open. Not wide open, but I'll take that. All right. We're going to give Cap some, some extra speed in case he's got room to take off. I see X. Dots. Come on now. 10 seconds. Oh, yeah, we're up 21, baby. All right, y'all. Nothing before half, man. Oh, oh, he did the... He did a halfback pass. I was like, you really ran it out. All right, so at halftime, I think I've seen everything I need to here. This is pretty much... What this feels like for me, kind of... To give a Madden analogy, it kind of feels like our, our solo challenge right here. So, obviously, this is good for people, you know, that just clearly aren't as much of gaming specimens is your boy you know they start you with the weak overall team you go against and i'm sure they'll just get harder and harder but right now this is probably too easy for your boy so i'm not gonna have y'all see the rest of this game we'll see what we're gonna get into after this though okay yeah so this is definitely the route we want to go so you see this is our tour after we complete this a new one's going to be generated with better rewards i went ahead and you know finished that one game the next game i had was a max score game i only had to go to eight so it didn't take that long and that's cool because it makes me think all of these won't be very long. And that gives me hope that in our tournaments, we could change the games to like kind of how it was in NFL Street where you got to get to a certain score versus like a time. And this look, that next route or the next stop on my tour was just getting a, a free pack. Look, we have another max score game. So I actually want to show you guys this one. Hopefully the score isn't too high. I had to go to eight. So I could have won it in one possession. I was actually struggling with the team too a little bit that I was playing. I couldn't convert my two point conversion. So I had to get another score, but it was fun. I'm liking all the different like stadiums too. I think I only have one stadium unlocked. When we try to do the couch tournament, we couldn't find how to change the stadiums. And so maybe I just need more to unlock and hopefully this will allow me to do that. Oh, look, another, look, we gotta get to eight. So we might be able to put this one away on our first drive. And then after this, we'll open those packs. See what we're looking like. I have not seen a kick return in this game yet. I'm trying to get my first. Oh, he cloaked the defense. Let's go short then. Let's fluff off me. Dang it. Got him deep, I think. I don't know. Oh, no. Oh! No, what the fluff I'm doing? Just trust me. Oh, Colin Cap, you getting loose? You got none but space to the left? With my QB speed boosted, am I getting to the end zone? Get the fluff off me. All right, super speed for everybody. Ha, get that out of here. If I can get this, we win. Don't even have to think about it. No! Two-point conversions are hard, bro. No, nah, I'm impatient, bro. Give me this onside. Give me the rock right back. Hurt him. Hurt him. Dang it. I'm there. Come on now. That's good defense right there. Come on. Oh, pick. Oh, my guys can't catch, man. So I realize there's no punt return. At least I'm pretty sure there's no punt return. And so when they decide to punt, they just 
automatically put you in punt return. So I'm guess I'm hoping that means there's no fake punts. Cause that would be tough. I'm gone. Oh, good back juke. Fluff off me. Hold up. Can I get blocks? Got him deep. Throwing that thing up. That's bad defense. Run. Run. Be faster than you are, my ninja. That's not cool, man. I need the speed threat. Like, when you got a beat like that, you can't be getting caught, my boy. Can't be a thing. All right. That's another dub. And look, as you see, my guys are leveling up. And that's really the way, man. We're leveling up. You just got to grind these out, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? Oh, this is what it is. It had an X on it. It was throwing me off. Play a regular game with no wild cards available. Ooh. That's what I'm thinking, man. I want to try to finish this whole tour and see what we get for it. Just to see what that kind of grind looks like. But like I said, let's open some packs. Just to see, you know. Might get us better players that we could start using now. Start leveling up. Okay, we got us a cornerback and a safety. Ooh. Oh, super speed too. Magnet hands. Those are actually good wild cards to have. Those are ones I go to often. Got us a run ban. Some helmets we can mess with. I don't know those players, and I know them overalls are trash. But I'm kind of used to that now. Just got to get decent players and grind them. Okay, linebacker, D-line. What is this dude? Special shield? I don't think I can look at the info on the card here. Yeah, I can't even look at the info. So I don't know what that one does. And I don't know. I mean, Kadarius Tony, someone I know. Honestly, only from my mutt team. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I feel about any of those, to be honest. Something I also noticed is that I completed a daily challenge in one of the games. And so I think these might be worth looking into just because you can probably level up your stuff faster. So I won a game. I performed a SWAT. And if I complete three league games, beautiful. So what is my reward here? Oh, challenge points. And it's some sort of crate that I'm going to get or some kind of pack. What is that? I want it. So I need to complete some league games. All right, y'all, I'm going to bring you guys into this game already in action just because it got interesting. <laughs> this team is not better than me, but I got to an easy lead, right? And I'm kind of doing like, I feel, I feel like I'm doing solo challenges. So they legit did score on me one time, but then I stepped away for a little bit and like was letting the computer play and, and, and they scored again. Like, see, they're getting first downs, but they're not goaded. And my stick a little finicky. But the main reason I wanted to show you guys is they're really punting on fourth and inches. That's crazy. That's tough. But um, the main reason I wanted to show you guys some of this gameplay, probably the rest of this game, is because this is that game with no wild cards. I'm liking the flow. I think I like the game better with the wild cards. You know, just, just personal preference. At least I thought I did. Crap. I was locked up there. I'm just... I'm... I'm really enjoying this i kind of want you guys to just see the flow for a little bit like it definitely changes the flow you can't pass lead yeah they're they, bro they're locking me up yeah it's whatever is happening right now but as you see when there's no wild cards active like you know you get in you get out it's a little quicker yes oh i needed that yeah i was getting locked up and yeah i was embarrassed about it get the fluff off me boy you too all right, now let's run the rock. I definitely think the next tournament we're going to do... Oh, I messed that up. It's going to be no wild cards, just to see how that goes. And honestly, as I think about it, man, just how gaming works these days, like, imagine how this game is going to be a couple months from now, you know, with some updates, a couple patches. I might really be happy with this game. Like, now, I, I'm happy with it now. I'm just saying it could get, like, way better is what I'm saying. Dot wide open. Come on. Let's get it. Get off me! Uh, we get one stop, it's done. I really missed that because of the wind. That's crazy. I can't let them score or I lose. Yo, the wind is real strong in this game, man. You can't just mindlessly kick your stuff without paying attention. Wow, thought you could get me with the run. Give me that rock! And that's going to be a GG. Imagine, like, building a team with a bunch of heavy hitters, having a deck that goes well with it, where you're, like, constantly reducing their carrying or something like that, you know? Honestly, I don't even think I want to score here. I'm okay with this. You know, I'd love for this to be the last possession of the game. I think I'm okay with not getting the first down. 
or just barely getting it, that works too. All right, they're getting them timeouts off the board. That, that's cool. I'm okay. Honestly, I'm okay with kicking three here too if I need to. Yep, come on. Giving them timeouts. All right, last one. Fluff off me. I'm not even trying to score. All right, now I just can't fluff this up. I'm going to just take three because there's, there's no difference. Three or, or uh, Tutty. All right, one stop and we out of here. So what I definitely need y'all to let me know in the comments is one, um, how should we do this series, man? Do y'all want to see more of just the online players that I'm playing against? Do y'all want to see a mix of this? Like, I'm not showing much of this now because every team I'm going against, I'm better than, at least so far. But I know we're only going to get so far into it before, oh no. What's he doing? Okay, yeah, yeah, come here. I know eventually the teams will be better, and that might make it challenging, you know? So let me know if you guys want to see me focus more online or this. This might have different variety. Again, I don't even know what to expect. Hopefully at the end of this video, we see what the next tour looks like. I don't know how spicy it gets. And then let me know how you guys like the wild card, uh, the wild cards being gone. Which flow do you like better? The version that has the cards or the one without it? All right, let's see what these players looking like. All right, we have Colin leveling up, Taylor Lewin leveling up. Honestly, squeaked out a win against the computer. Not proud about it. He leveled up as well. Got a new pack, got two new packs. And I think we got... Yeah, two more to go. No, three more to go. All right, it is official. We have completed our first tour. At least we're about to because we just have to collect this pack for the final one. And boom, tour will be created with more games and rewards. Well, let's see what it's talking about. Why you, why you, oh, oh, oh. Branching paths? Is this what you tell me? Very interesting. Very, very interesting. So now, yeah, let me know in the comments, man. Would y'all want to see us continue, you know, to knock some of these out? Maybe in the same fashion. Let's see what... I just want to jump into this first one. See what the overall looks like. Because typically, we had an overall that was lower than ours. And yep, still 54. And you got to think, our, our overall is climbing the more we play. So some people got to really be grinding those, man. But let's open these packs. Let's see where we leave our team... At the end of this video, it's it's so weird because the more you play with your guys, the more they level up. And so, and, it, and if like the better players are low overalls too, like I wonder will I ever want to use these new guys? Like why put in a new 50 overall when, you know, I'm already leveling the one up I've had from jump. I don't know, maybe I pull some players that are like 60, 70. I think that's when I might sub them in, but like I'm not seeing any anything here worthy of replacing what I currently got. Let's end this looking at the team. We have an 89 offense and then i'm sorry a 59 offense and a 56 defense you know we have some rare cards it looks like those might start in the 60s or something or the epic these are epic and then i think legendary is what cap is maybe those start at 65 or something so it's like your players suck when you get them regardless like his stats max out at like 96 speed but look at where we're at now. So you just got to like really, really, really play with these cards. <laughs> and it takes, let me know, should we roll with uh, uh, CJ Stroud or Mr. Colin Kaepernick at quarterback? If we're going best overall, they would have Cap in. I'm sorry, they would have CJ in. I'm looking at his faster speed. That kind of makes me want to use him. And I feel like every other stat would be better too. So why the fluff would we, <laughs> why would we use Cap? outside of him having the afro i don't know let me know but that's gonna wrap it up here man definitely appreciate y'all rocking with your boy definitely plan on bringing y'all more wild card football let me know if you are enjoying it and until next time god first god bless